your name and your company? Tell me a little bit about that. So my name's Kate Holby, and this is Ajiri Tea. Um, it's a Kenyan black tea. The word Ajiri means to employ in Swahili, so we employ 63 women to make the labels that are dry banana bark, and every label is different because they're all handmade. Um, so it's, that's pretty cool. And then 100% of the profits go back to paying school fees for orphans in the same part of Kenya. I can show you on the map. It's um, Kisi, Kenya, which is in western Kenya. And we buy our tea from a factory in the same district or region of Kenya called Kisi. And um, we buy our tea from a factory called Nansiongo Factory. Um, it's managed by a woman, which we really like because this is kind of a girl power tea <laughs> employing woman. And it's owned by 12,000 small-scale farmers. Um, so it's kind of like a co-op. They grow their land on one to two acres. Um, so, yeah, so it's been really successful. We have 63 women making the labels and have just sent um, 19 kids to school. Um, and they're all in the top half of their class. They're doing amazingly well. Um, and it just won yesterday, as you can see right there, the Buyer's Choice Best Black Tea at the World Tea Expo and the North American Tea Champion for black tea. Wow, really interesting. Yeah. So um, how did that start? What's the story behind it creating and becoming an actual company? Yeah, so um, my uh, this is a company um, founded by my mother and my sister, who's off in this expo somewhere, and myself. And my mother studied abroad in Kenya um, for a semester, and then my sister studied abroad in Kenya for a semester, and she went back over there after she graduated to work for an NGO that delivered, you know, food and drugs um, to people with HIV AIDS. And with this recession, um, it lost its funding. So there were hundreds of people um, who were really dependent, reliant, and it just stopped. So I went over there to visit her, and we were just together thinking of a way that um, we could make something more sustainable. And Employing women is great because they tend to reinvest a lot back into their families and communities, so that is the goal. And they're doing amazing things. These women, they are, um, you know, sending their own kids to school. They are buying cows. They're renting land. They all put their shillings together and built a roof, kind of a shelter where they could where they could make these labels. So it's some women got electricity in our house for the first time. So it's a really really positive. Um, change. Sounds like a company that's really um, giving people an opportunity to have um, a better life or all of that. That's really cool. I've actually never seen a tea like that. Um, could you tell me a little bit more about maybe um, the families? Like, are they are they more lower lower class? Yeah, so I mean, if you can, I don't know if you can see the slideshow, but you can see exactly where they live. Really rural villages. Um, yeah. So that explains a little bit about it. All in Kisi, all trying to employ, and the women pick an orphan from their community to send to school. So it's been a real, real positive. Wow. Yeah. Cool. Well, with all of that, that's a great story already, but do you have any other tea stories that you know of uh, with this Kenya, oh, this Kenya tea? Um, other tea stories. Well, actually, there is a funny kind of story that I could say. Um, so they, we get all these labels. We have a coworker, Nick, who's a Kenyan over there. He's my sister's age. He's around like 25, and he, um, he's, he collects the labels from the women's groups, pays them, kind of runs everything over there. And we kept on getting labels with these really fierce-looking birds. You can see the top one, right? And we, we asked Nick, Nick, why are we getting these all these labels with birds on them? I mean, they're great, but like, why are we getting all these labels? And he said, well, the woman um, said that you know the American people really like eagles. So they're eagles. So. Uh, that's, uh, that's kind of fun. I like that. <laughs> that's really great. Yeah.